Vegas day one, it's our third day of our trip, but uh, first day fully in Vegas. We're going to have a bit of fun today because it's the last day before the hard work begins. So we're going a little bit of outing now. None of us except uh, Rob behind the camera know what the hell we're doing now. This afternoon, eh, we'll see. A little bit of fun maybe. You might have heard that Vegas is in the middle of a desert, and I think that's uh, proven most by just jumping in a car. Two, three minutes outside of Vegas, absolutely nothing to see apart from the road ahead. I'm walking like a dick and you're just filming it. <laughs> Rightio, well, uh, just something a little different this morning. We've, uh, we've come to the snow. Again, just, uh, what, 45 minutes an hour out of Las Vegas. Snow, minus zero temperatures. Snowballs from idiots. And there's a ski resort up the hill, but they wouldn't let us go there because we're not skiing. Bro. Um, it's cold. Very cold. That was fantastic. Cold, although I do have the appropriate gear on from the waist up. Are you on? Do you want something from me? Yeah. It's extremely cold. It's um, it's hard. It's slippery. We're not built for this. It's supposed to be hot. It's desert. That's all I can think of. I do love the fact that you can get pretty much every, it's like Melbourne, four seasons in one day. We've got the snow, we've got the desert, we've got the city, it's fantastic in Las Vegas. So, good to see the snow. What a fantastic play area for the kids though. Tobogganing is huge, but let me tell you, if you don't dress properly for it, it's bloody cold. So yesterday we tried five guys. The idea was which is better, five guys or in and out. I'm going to say it straight up. I'm going in and out. Moen? In and out all the way. It's quality. You can taste that. In and out. <laughs> What's the finish? <laughs> Does it have to be that quick? Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a flop. Hang on. We, we, we agreed Jeff was going to be the one that would. Number one radio rule. Don't talk over each other. <laughs> Mate, number one radio quality rule. You can taste. Listen to the production There's meeting. three hamburgers on offer. They do it well. In and out for me. Happy side. Detroit Five Guys was better, but that was terrible. For me, Five Guys is great when it's good. What's it like? Can, not... you, can you make an analogy? Up? Can I... <laughs> I can. So picture the girl next door. Generally, always quite good. That's your in and out. And then there's that one girl you'll see at the club who's stunning, but then the next day you bump into her and she's rubbish. That's five guys. When it's good, it's great. When it's bad, it's horrible. Ladies and gentlemen, Jeff Quattromani. <laughs> Married. <laughs> Married. We're just heading back to the hotel, but we're getting our first look at the LVCC Las Vegas Convention Center, where CES will actually be over the next few days. So pretty impressive to see it all getting underway. Right, yeah, what is it? Uh, it's Monday here in Las Vegas. Uh, the show literally starts tomorrow in terms of press day and things. So, we have a few hours left. We might just let our hair down and see what the night entails uh, with LG, but we might do a little fun before then. Let's go. Put your hair down. <laughs> Uh, Monday Arvo, I've uh, surprised the boys with a little uh, little trip to the uh, Las Vegas airport because we are going to take a chopper ride, a uh, little private chopper ride. Should be fun. Mate, really excited. I've flown in a Hercules private jet and just ordinary planes and this is the one I've never done. So, ticking it off the list, ready to go. 
Any fears? No, no, it'll be fine. What's the worst that can happen? It's been a long time between drinks. 27 years ago was my last fight for Chopper. I was nine. Now I'm 36. I'm a better person, of course, these days. Should be able to handle it. I'll be right. I am way less than I expected to. At the moment, pretty good. I uh, really want to see what I look like in about an hour's time. It's been about uh, 20, oh, 27 years for me too. So, um, last uh, one wasn't the very best ride. So, hopefully a bit better today. Feeling great, loving the boys are a bit excited. Got the surprise through, I don't do surprises as well, so I've nailed this. Looking forward to uh, an interesting little, uh, little flight. You sure? We'll be right, won't we? Most important, please do not open the doors. Yeah. <laughs> they don't lock. If you pull the handle, yeah. the door will open. I am. <laughs> Right here, we're on board, ready to rock and roll now. The boys are in the back, with three of us in the front. It feels like Bowen's flying, which worries me a bit, but we are on our way. Last time I spoke, we were just getting into a chopper. Yep, that was uh, good enough. That was a bit of a surprise. Yep. And uh, rather than land back at the airport, we've landed here at Exotics Racing. This is where you can hire a Ferrari, land again, whatever you like. Yeah. Boys, are you ready for a few laps? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Pump the boat off. I'm in a state of shock. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> no different here. Bit unsure what's going on, but uh, looking forward. So we'll go out. We'll have a few laps. Uh, we may be competitive. We may have a time to run. See you. Well, the fun. time. There'll be Bring time. On. Yeah. <laughs> You're a good driver until a professional sits next to you and tell you what you're doing wrong. We were pretty quick, he said I went okay. Probably could work on late braking, taking the apexes a little bit tighter, but wow, what, it's so much fun. I don't know what speed you were doing, but it was very quick, a little over 200, I think. But anyway, I'm shaking. I've got another lap to go in a different car. <laughs> that was amazing, absolutely amazing. It's a bit more over time now, so what are they worth? It's about 400, about 83, I should be ready for one thing. Look, the big news, we did get times, guys, and I was fastest. <laughs> so all an afternoon there, uh, helicopter lands at a racetrack and we get to drive Ferraris, Porsche, Audis, Nissans, and more Ferraris. Uh, good news, it was time lapse and I was fastest. 
Uh, Bowen second, Jeff third by about four seconds. And Pete <laughs> on debut, not too bad at all. So great afternoon.